There's a few things I've learned in this life. In Selma, there is a lesson to be learned. You learn a lot in 90 years. Anybody home? If you really want to live, find something worth dying for. Do justly, yes. love mercy, and walk humbly with thy God. Love is the final fight. If an American, because his skin is dark, cannot enjoy the full and free life which all of us want, then who among us would be content to have the color of his skin changed and stand in his place? Your order to disperse that march will not continue. Suffering is not the last word. Joy comes in the morning. You was made for a purpose before the war began. Find it. You was made to have a place and a people. Love them. When you find that purpose in that kind of people, run at it to the very end. Welcome to One Life Well Lived. My name is Christopher Brooks. In this course, we're gonna study the life of Dr. John M. Perkins. You'll learn about how racism impacted his life, but even more importantly, how his commitment to reconciliation impacted the lives of many, many more. When I see you first, way out there, I'm afraid of you. But if you get close to me, I see you're human. Come close to me. We can do this together. It's got to be together. Separate makes people unequal. <laughs> That's my view of it. Yes, it is. I'm almost at the end of my race. I've run hard. This is my purpose and manifesto. What is your purpose?